What's up guys, I'm Tom LFC Evan and welcome to the top 10 best 10 players on FIFA 15, the full game and it's coming out, the demo is coming out um, tomorrow on Xbox and PC and the day after tomorrow to, for PlayStation so you can expect the FIFA 15 series to start in two days so if you are new to my channel make sure to subscribe and like the video if you are excited for FIFA 15 videos and guys these are the top 10 best players on the whole game so let's get straight into it Eden Hazard now is an 88 rated left midfielder and uh, I don't think uh, he had the greatest of seasons he had a terrible World Cup yes he was brilliant uh, for Chelsea in the Premier League but he could have been even better um, so uh, I think EA should have improved uh, Yaya Toure's rating for example a uh, lot more and uh, Eden Hazard now uh, 89 pace 82 shooting 91 dribbling he's one of the best dribblers on the game and right, rightfully so 84 passing 4 star weak foot 4 star skill moves he will, wor he will be worth an absolute bomb on uh, ultimate team and career mode and then we have a Frank Ribery who is, uh, who is in the center of major controversy now that he uh, retired from uh, the France international, uh, fr from international football. And he, uh, he's one of the few players who have five-star skill moves on the game. And rightfully so, he had a great season. I think he got downgraded. He was an 89-rated player um, on, uh, on FIFA 14. Um, correct me if I'm wrong in the comments 89 pace, 78 shooting, 92 dribbling, 85 passing and then we have Bastian Schweinsteiger who had a great season with Bayern Munich he won the league, he won the German Cup he won um, the World Cup with Germany and uh, he's still an 88 rated player just like on FIFA 14 so he didn't get upgraded um, but he will be one of the best center midfielders on the game to use the only major weakness that he has is his pace but otherwise great passing shooting and dribbling physical and defending stats and then we have Luis Suarez who Liverpool sold to Barcelona for 75 million pounds and he got a big upgrade he started as an 86 rated player on FIFA 14 then he got upgraded to an 88 rated player in the second half of the season and now he's an 89 rated striker the Barcelona attack is just out of this world man so um, 85 uh, sorry 83 pace 87 shooting one of the best shooters of the game I think he maybe might be uh, even uh, worth a 90 rated card to be honest because he was the best striker last season um, in the world in my opinion Ronaldo and Messi don't play as a striker so that's why I'm saying Suarez but even Suarez, Suarez even, only maybe Ronaldo had a better season than Suarez last season I think a shame he couldn't win the league with Liverpool the dribbling the shooting I, I can't wait to play with, with Barcelona man that would be so much fun and then we have Andres Iniesta who uh, who is an 89 rated player he didn't get a downgrade and uh, it's weird because Xavi got downgraded by uh, by three uh, ratings I think Xavi was an 89 as well and uh, he is now an 86 rated player Iniesta had a great season with Barcelona but I don't really understand why Xavi got downgraded by so much and Iniesta didn't so let me know what do you think about this in the comments below and then we have Manuel Neuer the best goalkeeper on the game holy cow look at those stats is 90 rated I think this is the first time in a long long time that there is a 90 rated goalkeeper on the game and I think it's deserved because he is he is amazing just amazing he, he won so many trophies with Bayern Munich and Germany in the recent seasons and then we have Zlatan Ibrahimovic who got upgraded by one but this is a cause of major major controversy his skill moves from five star skills got downgraded to four star skills why on earth would EA do this I mean come on he had a brilliant season an amazing season with Paris Saint-Germain before he got injured he was firing in goals left right and center in the league and in the Champions League and he won the league with Paris Saint-Germain and he, he won the uh, a cup as well 
And why on earth would EA downgrade his skill moves? I had no idea. He's still a brilliant card and he got upgraded, rightfully so. But if they upgrade their, their, his rating, why did they downgrade their skill moves? I just don't get EA. There will be so few 5-star skillers on the game now that the Brazilian League won't be on there. And the next player is Arian Robben, who, is a, who got upgraded from an 89, 88 to a 90 rated player. And what a card he has. 93 pace, 86 shooting, 83 passing, 92 dribbling. And he would be one of the best players on the game if he had like 4 star skill, 4 star weak foot, sorry. He's, he has 4 star skill moves, yes. But his weak foot I think lets him down a little bit. And then we have Cristiano Ronaldo. And I think EA messed this up again. Because Ronaldo had his best season of his life last season. And he didn't get an upgrade. Why? What the fuck, EA? Come on, man. What are you doing? Yes, his stats got upgraded. But why didn't they upgrade his rating? He has 5-star skill moves, 4-star weak foot, and rightfully so. And he has 93 shooting. I think that's uh, the best card on Ultimate Team that you can get. Because he has everything. He is fast. He can finish. He can dribble. Can, he can, you can do skill moves, you can do long shots with Ronaldo, he can head the ball, he's tall, he's powerful, he has uh, strength, everything. Shame is just not the same rated. Messi got downgraded and rightfully so because he was injured for a long time last season and uh, he didn't have the best of seasons. But still, Ronaldo should be 93 rated, same as Messi in my opinion, on the game. He has 4 star skill moves, 3 star weak foot. And a great shooting, passing and pace and dribbling. But you know, because he, Messi is a small player and not really uh, powerful, I think um, Ronaldo is a much better option on ultimate team and career mode. I, I, I think EA should fix it somehow that Messi plays, li plays like Messi plays in real life. So maybe they should do like... Uh, special uh, special things with his card so let me know guys what do you think about all these player ratings in the comments below and i'm so so excited uh, for the fifa 15 uh, videos fifa 15 uh, carrier mode and ultimate team and all the videos to bring to you guys so thanks for watching like the video if you enjoyed this leave a comment what do you think see you later guys have a nice day goodbye